We're shooting a video here at my house and the title of the song is Backyard Party and we just have this great space and we thought about, hey, let's just have a huge barbecue and invite all our friends to come over and just shoot a video. She's a great singer, a great dancer, great organizer, and as a human being, there's there's no one like her. She's got a big heart, and um, she really works with people um, of all ages. When I got here, I expect I had been on uh, done previous shoots and stuff, and I figured we were going to be sitting around and stuff, and not no, not feeling like we knew anybody. But today's celebration was joyous. The, the people's energy was great. The, seeing the kids, you know, do express themselves through the dance and the, the track. This was the first time I'd heard Gladys's track, and it is killer. The whole theme of, of, of bringing together people of all ages and cultures and, and, and expressing that in the music really says a lot about where her heart is at and the fact that it promotes, you know, um, get-togethers and celebrations that are minus the typical um, media-driven uh, image of, you know, sex, drugs, and rock and roll, you know. This was a great, uh, a great example that you can do things creatively that have a lot of energy minus, you know, the, uh, the negative influences that, that we're surrounded with in this society. It was really great to be here today and to uh, see all the different age groups here together in a really fun, supportive uh, atmosphere uh, as a teacher of 32 years, uh, elementary school. It just really made me feel good to uh, see the children out enjoying music and dance, something really positive. You know, there's so many negative things going on today and it was just great to see everybody here and the parents were here. and. We had the drums going and the kids were interested in doing that and the little bitty kids were out there doing everything the uh, older children were doing and that was great. The uh, older children accepted that and included them and it was just a, a wonderful atmosphere and I'm just really happy that I was able to be a part of it today. Super. I think the concept backyard party is very brilliant in the sense that it allows so many different people to come together and to fellowship and to have fun in a positive atmosphere. You have different age brackets, you it's very multicultural, the music was positive and I think it was just a great opportunity to come out and enjoy a backyard party and I think it's something that needs to be promoted because we always have parties and different events for family and friends. That was our whole purpose was to do that. We wanted to just bring like um, I'm Cuban, so you know, very family family atmosphere and uh, the Cuban elements, and just have you know people of all ages and and just the dancing and the kids and and we wanted to bring that back. I don't think we see enough of that in video. Can I see hands of freestyles? Are you one person or one group? Milo is like a brother to me. Anything more that we catch is, is a blessing for us. Milo was the first team. dance team that so I was ever in. It's, jump in, jump in. You okay? That looks good. That's good. That looks I good. tell my, my dancers that I was like a sponge. I just came to him and just learned and I soaked you everything up. You have to concentrate up. on being intimate because then you can be in the lens. Okay. If you drop your hat, pick it up. No, you did, you did perfect. What you did was perfect. There was this chemistry between him and I since the first time I met him. Through that, we just became like literally brother and sister, and he's like I said, he's like family now. And you know, you know, the guy he directed the the video, and so he's multi talented. He's done it all, and we're just happy and blessed to be able to have him be part of this. I think he's kid friendly. I think he does things from his soul versus just his mind and his brain. And he just knows the basics so that he can break it down so children can understand. One group, you're gonna be number four. What I'm gonna do is call out each group's one, two. Don't be shy, get in there, get out. He's gonna teach my son. I'm a non-dancing child. Going at the wrong person. Oh, you're not going? Any other freestyles? You ready to go? You getting the mailman? The mailman's gonna come and jam with Cuba. And you guys are gonna be like, you know what I mean? Just okay. hype up the mailman. Milo's got this big energy, this big heart that include makes you feel included. <laughs> Can I have your attention? Heads up. Atmos people, this is Lamont. Round of applause for Lamont. Oh. 
Yeah. You're a real mailman. A real He's a real mailman. Oh, yeah. 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 <laughs> He's got this way of making things happen without really making it happen. The mailman starts off the freestyle. Okay. Here we go, roll audio! My favorite thing about Milo, about him directing this video, and one of the dancers and I were actually talking to him earlier today and telling him that he's got such an even keel going on throughout his, his character and personality throughout the entire video. While he's doing it, he's not like, da -da 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 -da. he's just, his, his spirit is just totally calm throughout the entire thing. Go! Same thing! <laughs> He's definitely one of a kind. I met Milo when he um, was teaching um, in the fitness industry, teaching hip hop. Wave, wave. Then I take his class out in Martin Henry, and he always just treated me like he knew me um, forever. He gave me like hip hop music, and so he became my mentor. And from him, I um, teach hip hop. And up to this day, he still works with me on choreography, and I'm ever so grateful for all his kindness and his great just creativity. So number two! I just love the enthusiasm he gives. You guys did a piece when I came to the school. It was fierce. Number three! Judging from uh, people that I have worked with in the past, I'd have to say he's really a genuine person. Somebody say ho! ho! Say ho! ho! Say ho! 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 ho. ho. Can you say yo baby, yo baby, yo? Yo baby, yo baby, Can you yo. say go baby, go baby, go? Go baby, go baby, yo. Go Cuba, go Cuba. Cuba is an amazing woman, a great dancer, a great mentor, and just an encourager, and just really challenged me on, on a lot of things in life. And I, my experience with her has just been a blessing. And this video is such a reflection of who she really is. Action! Background action as well! The script was just portraying what she does, who she is, just partying in the backyard, doing her hip-hop, dancing and singing with her friends and family, being real, not being fake, not being um, what a lot of artists are in Hollywood right now trying to portray someone that they're not. When the um, executive producer comes up and signs her, um, and he looks at her and says, that's exactly what I want. That's who I want. And it's such a magical moment because he captures her in that real moment. And that's such a rare thing to see. Hold up the pin. Everybody cheer for Cuba. The industry is, we know it's very rough and you know, you gotta be a certain look, you gotta weigh this, this amount of weight. The purpose behind what I do is to motivate, you know, anybody, young people, the young at heart, that, you know, we can follow our dreams and we can do what we purpose in our hearts to do. Cuba, go Cuba, go Cuba, go Cuba.